Yes, she thought she was dreaming because uh, prior to that she was she was napping. So I guess when the bus began to uh, flip, she heard some screaming and stuff, but she thought it was all a dream. Scary moments for a group of eighth grade students from Philadelphia on their way to Washington, D.C. for a field trip. Their charter bus became involved in an accident on I-95 in Haver de Grace. A lot of the kids that were there, which are pretty much a lot of injuries, were a lot of scared, just trying to physically take care of them, but also emotionally, too. 26 students on board, along with two teachers, one parent chaperone, and one driver. A teacher and a student were flown to hospitals with critical injuries, the rest taken to area hospitals for treatment, most with relatively minor injuries like cuts, bruises, and broken bones. I mean, this kind of uh, accident was uh, very traumatic for them. Um, they weren't sure how hurt they were. We weren't sure how hurt they were. Um, they were scared. They were crying. I mean, it was typical of anyone who was in a major accident. The Philadelphia school system learned of the accident and sent staff down to the crash scene and counselors to the Charles W. Henry School where the children attend. We have reached um, most of the parents. We've been un unable to reach uh, uh, several of the parents. We've left messages and, and uh, planning to go by uh, the addresses that we have for those individuals. Some of the children have already been released from the hospital. Their parents coming to pick them up and take them home, glad they're safe, but still needing to do a lot of talking about what they went through. Um, she didn't say too much, but she's a strong young lady. Um, she was just, she was more concerned for her friends, her classmates, um, her teachers. Doctors here expect all the patients that were treated here to be discharged today. Reporting live in Haver to Grace, Kim Dacey, WBAL TV 11 News.